Hello guys, today's video I am going to show you how to fix this problem. The procedure entry point could not be located in the dynamic link library. So first you have to go to your windows set bar and just type for the CMD and right click on it and click on run as administrator. So here you have to just type a command of SFC specialized scan now and hit enter. So it is scanning for all the R corrupted files. You can just wait for it and minimize it so let's move to our next step which has you can go to any browser and here you can just search for the visual c++ redistributable package download visual studio 2013 and just hit enter so when you search it open up the first link open up the first website and when you open it so this type of dashboard was open so here you can select the language and click on the download so when you choose language and click on the download so it is asking for the choose the version so i'm going to show you if you have 64 bit you can download for 64 bit if you have 32 bit so how to check your system type go to your set bar and here you can just type for the settings and go to your windows system settings you will see on the first go to your system setting and just let us scroll down and click on the about so here you will see the system type so i have the 64 bit operating system so here you can see for the windows operating system type and so i can download for the 64 bit and click on it and click on the download so if you have any if you have 32 bit you can download for the 32 bit so it is started downloading and so after the download is complete you can just click on this folder option so you can just right click on it and click on it send to here you can find the send to and click on this desktop create shortcut so when you click on it so it is sent it to our desktop and here you can see it is sent to our desktop and you can just uh, right click on it and click on this run as administrator so the setup of the visual studio code was opening and click on this run option so here you can just click on the yes option and when you click on it you have click on this i agree and click on the install so it will take some time to install so finally our Microsoft Visual Studio 2013 has set up and successfully installed. So you can just close it. So after this you have to open the command prompt. So here you can see Windows Craft Files has successfully repaired. So this is the way you can fix the problem of the procedure entry point could not be found. This is the way you can just fix it. You can follow the same step I can show so please hit the subscribe button for little videos like this and uh, if you like this video please subscribe to our channel